Hey, everybody. Carbacius, we welcome. We're going to do the uh, finest uh, full case number seven Rip City Cards style right now. If in, uh, you would like to come this way, I would be happy to uh, get you in on this. That is something that I am definitely interested in. Uh, Cam, I am definitely interested in. Well, I mean, who doesn't need their blankie? Is there a hitless on uh, finest? I mean, autographs one ones are are what would be considered hitless. Autograph or w what would be considered hits? Autos one ones. I do like my blankie. Yeah, 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 no, no. Well, I mean, really, in anything that we do, Cam. I mean, in any in anything that we do, autos one on ones is is what we is what we consider hitless. I mean, I there if there. It, I mean, I, listen, I, okay, I, I will do a better job about specifying in, in descriptions about it, but in general, it's always uh, autos, one-on-ones, but I will make a point to uh, say in the descriptions going forward what it, uh, what it is. That's on me. Okay, it's this way. Yep. No, no. I mean, again, I should I should have been better about uh, about about specifying it. I mean, because you know, a lot of people look at hits in a lot of different ways. So I mean, any questions that you ever have, like I am, I am more than happy to uh, to, an to answer for you. How are you doing this? Uh this lovely Friday, by the way. I mean, I guess. Well, no, it was, Oh shit! It's Saturday, right? Dang, we all we already halfway into the weekend, and I and I don't and I did not did not even know it. Yes, Kate AC actually owns a uh, owns a can. Justin, if I had to guess, I would say probably not.
Yeah. We're having uh, sleep issues with it. Uh, with the thing that I own that is named Penelope right now. Like, she don't, she don't, she don't want to go to sleep. She ain't interested. So you, so you have got a hustler. You, you have raised a hustler. Yeah, dude. I don't know. I have all. I have just been firmly against the cry it out method for having baby sleep. Like from talking to like my therapist and psychiatrist and like my internet type research. Like I don't think there's anything good that comes out of just having a baby like cry themselves to sleep. You know, like you just I don't I don't I'm not down with it. I'm not down with it. So, you know, that just turns you into a, a whole nother situation of how, how you going to, how you going to, like, ramp that thing down that is just a, an absolute machine of energy. So, yeah, wife is, uh, yeah, mildly stressed about it. Well, you you just like you just just like put put him in a crib and just like just just let him let him go until he finally was like I can't take and go to sleep. I just I mean listen, I mean I, I I'm too deep at this point. To change, to change systems. I mean, I already basically like lay in my bed, like facing the crib, like waiting for, waiting for her to like wake up, and she doesn't even like always like cry when she wakes up. Like I'll just sense her standing in her crib, and like very occasionally I'll, I'll hear her say. Like, Mama, and you know, then it's, I mean, it's like you know, a lightning bolt through me that I'm like snatching her up, feeling through the crib, looking for her pacifier that she that she has you know it, you know dropped or just not used at some point, trying to just you know then 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 immediately drop into your into the chair. That uh, you were kind enough to uh, to give me to like try and get you know get her back under control, and then back in bed. And then by the third time it happens during the night, I just say like "f it," and I I just I put her in bed in between Jenny and I and. Uh, just then just go to sleep and just wait for her to like completely like turn like near well well that would be 180 degrees in the bed so that uh, there is a foot uh, on the back of my head but just be happy that I don't have to uh, get up again Dude, I just can't. I, I, just can't, I can't do it. I, I, couldn't, I, I could not move her. Like, knowing that she might be in, like, some other room, awake, staring into just darkness, not knowing where we are, and, like, like just being, like, upset, I, I just can't do it. I'm probably going to be ruining her for the rest of her life, but... I know it's, I can't, I just, I can't, I have to know that she is 
comfortable and happy and, you know, as being as, as just as comfortable as she can humanly be. I can sleep when I die, you know? I mean, that, that, that's kind of my kind of my rationale with this. Yeah, I mean, listen, the wife is still, is still discussing, you know, still saying like, oh, you know, uh, we need another one. And see, I mean, that's like a little bit of my worry, is that, uh, is it like, Penelope has been like the, like, Every every single ever mother father we have talked to has been like, oh my gosh, like she just did that, like, in like like not you know like progressive wise, but like oh she just like stopped breastfeeding, like she just like drinks that and like you know like she has been next level easy, like eats everything you put in her face. I mean, it's, I mean, and even the sleep thing, to me, it's not, like, that big of a deal. She just wants, I mean, she wants to see what's going on. Like, I mean, she's, like, she eventually blacks out. It's just later than, you know, mom would like it to be. But, I mean, she didn't, I mean, she doesn't fuss. She didn't cry when she was little. Like, I mean, she has just been, like, and the easiest baby ever. I legit worry, like, what would happen if we had another one and it was, like, the worst baby ever. Because, like, I'm not, I'm not a patient person. Like, I mean, I can be and I try my best to be, but I'm not, I, you know, I'm just not. I'm not like that patient. Like, I mean, if 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 we had another one and it was just like a hell like a hell spawn, like, I don't know how I would handle it. I don't know, and I and I were and I I just I mildly worry about. It. Okay, we'll start off with a uh, Eddie Rosario Superfractor for the Twins. A uh, Uno e Uno. Yeah, I mean, I guess there is always like good and bad stuff there, but uh, there isn't. Uh, Eddie Rosario, Super for the Twins. Jamie, there you go. First card out. I mean, this case can only get better. Buxton Refractor. Pooh Holes to 250. Dude, this Telez guy, I have just been like up his butt with uh, autographs. Yeah, man, a, dude, a super equals a one of one, period. I mean, there's, it's just, I mean, that's it. The Grom Refractor. Hoskins Refractor. Yeah, I, I I'll send it. I I send it to K A C. You don't you don't really need that, Jamie. You don't really need that. 
Tim Anderson, Refractor. Chance Adams, uh, autograph for the Yankees. Blackman Refractor. A Baruki autograph for the Blue Jays. Yep, Jamie and Joy, you are one of one autograph or one of one uh, card. Only one in existence. The Bogarts. Uh, Refractor. There are no other ones. Literally. Yeah, Kate AC. UPS did not come on Friday, so. You'll have an extra nice pile on Saturday. Chris Shaw, rookie autograph. The Giants. Chris Shaw, refractor. Sheffield, refractor. I don't know. I have I I don't know. I I, I have mixed feelings about uh well nice uh Framel Reyes for the Padres. That's a nice card nice, nice Padres card. He uh he R O Y potential. Like bothering to get one of ones graded. You know, like, I, I kind of don't feel like it changes the value that much. No, I mean, it'll be it'll be Friday. I mean, in, unless you want it delayed in some fashion, it will be it will be Saturday. And a Tatis Jr., Another ROY a candidate for the Padres. Okay. All right. Just to let me let me know on like a Thursday you know that you would like that you would like it sent on the Friday. Uh, I'm leaning to 250 and it, and it, and it shall be. How are they going to put you on call though, man? You put people on call. That's that's some BS. That's some straight BS. All right, let me write it down. It's been written down. Now that it's been written down. It's basically like in stone, except on paper stone. More or less. Sheffield to two fifty. A uh, Buxton two fifty. Christian Stewart in green for the T Grays. Autograph style. Two nine nine. Correa refractor. Bowers to uh one fifty. Pujols refractor. A Bryce Wilson autograph. For the uh, Braves baseball organization. 
Everybody loves the Braves baseball organization. Is that Granky Refractor, Bogarts at 250? Smoke Refractor. A Urias Padres Green Refractor Autograph to 99. Padres, uh, really kind of uh, killing this thing right now. Giolito Refractor. Posey to 150 in blue. Brad Keller Royals autograph to uh, 150. Hot fancy Royals. Con Queso. Aaron Judge Refractor. Ramirez Refractor. This over here. Put this over here. Uh, I think you do, yeah. Yeah. You got the Padres, man. You got the Padres. I mean, I mean, actually, I mean, the Tatis is is actually a very good card. Like, there's high potential he ends up being Rookie of the Year. Lindor to 250. Polanco Refractor. A, uh, another Christian Stewart autograph for the T Grays. No, wait. No, huh? What? No, oh, wait. He's waiting. Oh, uh, oh, no. I, I am sorry, KDC. I thought I, I, I glanced then. I thought I saw Bob. No, Bob has the uh, has the Padres. Scherzer to uh, ninety nine. It actually looks like you don't uh, have any teams in this. May, you maybe you're thinking about number eight that you might might have a team in and probably don't. That's probably what you're thinking about. Cassiano's refractor. If anybody is uh, watching this video, okay, AC doesn't have any teams in this. Mookie Betts to 150. He thought he might have. Hey, Kyle Tucker Astros to 25. Nice card. Very nice. Orange Wave. Fancy hotness. Nice. Dude, I mean, listen, Kyle Tucker is like 17 years old. I mean, if he if he can manage to put on another 20 pounds of muscle, dude will produce a Chapman uh, refractor. Trout refractor. And a Eloy Jimenez, 25 for the White Sox. A little bit of White Sox uh, fanciful action this. Nice card. Yeah, dude, I wish Bob was here in the room to even to see it. And Eric Hosmer refractor. But I mean he can watch he can watch the video later and and see how uh see how see how much he crushed it.
That is good, though. Uh, good for baseball, because that just means he's going to be like, you know, like he going to have like a solid stance. A hey, Kyle Tucker refractor. A hey, uh, Chris Bryant for the Cubs. Oh God, I, lo I love Queso. I love Queso. <clears throat> Rizzo refractor Vato to ninety nine. D. Gordon Refractor. <laughs> and a Kyle Tucker Gold to 50. Finest autographs. Kyle Tucker Hot Crushing Action. On this uh, business, finest firsts, gold to fifty. Dude, I mean, finest has legit been very nice. Like, not even me just like trying to sell the rest of it. Like, it has been very solid. Syndergaard uh, refractor, a ton of low numbered action. Nice autographs. I mean, clean looking cards. Like, I'm very impressed. A Lindor to 50. Gallo Refractor. Telez to 250. All that, that Telez, man, he is. I have, I have just about hit the Telez rainbow. Except for uh, Red and Super, I think. I'm pretty close to it. And a gold Vlad. Finest first gold refractor Vlad. Sick case, man. Absolutely insane. A studio refractor. Just bonkers, man. I mean, just bonkers. All right, let me... I got everything else here. These are all... Oh, that's all refractor. So, we have got a Chris Bryant for the Cubs, a Christian Stewart, rookie for the Tigers, a Brad Keller to 150, blue for the Royals, Urias to 99 for the Padres, a Bryce Wilson uh, for the Braves, rookie style, Christian Stewart, green to 99 for the Tigers, Tatis, nice card for the Padres, rookie. Reyes, nice card for the Padres. Shaw for the Giants, rookie. Baruki for the Blue Jays, rookie. Chance Adams for the Yankees. A Telez, finest first for the Blue Jays. The disgusting gold Vlad. It is redemption style, which I just I would like to see it in my hands, but still ridiculous to 50. Kyle Tucker, finest first to 50 for the Astros. Eloy Jimenez to 25 for the White Sox. And these are on card. These insert autographs on card. Another Kyle Tucker, finest first to 25, Orange Wave. And a Rosario, super non-auto 101. Absurd, man. Absolutely absurdly nice. I could not, I mean, just really, really disgusting. Really disgusting. Thank you, everybody. We just round two.